turn toward me and look so weak I've never seen you with such tired eyes And everything Hello YouTube, is that Game Tamer here and today I'm doing a tutorial on how to install the Red Dead 2 Simple Trainer and also how to install Red Dead 2 Script Hook. So I'm excited because it's only been two days since Red Dead 2 PC has been out. And I would like to say since Script Hook is out for Red Dead 2, get ready for some insane mods. That's all I gotta say. Like I'm ready to see horses with jetpacks. I'm ready to see Iron Man in the Wild West. There's going to be some insane mods. Also, I did message a creator who made the Iron Man mod for GTA, who also made the Spider-Man Thanos mod. His name's Julio Nib. He's a big um, GTA modder. I did message him and he said he will be looking into making mods for Red Dead 2, which is exciting. I don't know what to tell you guys, but that is super exciting. And also, there's this one um, group that's called Red Dead Modders. And as you can see here, they, they've they been working on some stuff in the works too. They have some stuff in the works too. Like, look at this. A zombie horse. Like, this would be cool. Like, if we can have this in PC. Also, get ready to see cars. And get ready to see everything. Like, zombies and Red Dead. That's gonna be so awesome. Like, wow. Get ready. Let's not get carried away. Let me show you guys how to install this. Okay, so uh, this is simple. All you need to do is, uh, if you don't have account for Nexus Mods, create an account and uh, just click the download right here where it says manual. Click that and it will download the file for you. All right, this mod is still in development. Uh, these are all new mods that just recently came out, so they're in development. Script hook mod is, um, right now, script hook, you would just download it there's not scripts out yet at the moment you will need this mod when uh crazy mods come out so it's good to know how to install script hook just now because it is different than the gta process and same thing for this you just click download and i do see they updated it recently what the hell all right this one comes with the trainer i guess all right so let me show you guys how to install both of these mods All right, so the script hook mod is simple to install. It does say right here, do not unpack script hook into Red Dead 2 folder. All right, so for the script hook mod, all you have to do is create a new folder at your desktop. Drag the files in the script hook folder to this folder that's at your desktop. All right, so they're in the script hook folder. All right, we have successfully installed that. We can X this out. All right, now for Lenny Simple Trainer. All you have to do is open up the file location for Red Dead 2. Mine is in this PC, local disk, program files, Rockstar Games, and Red Dead 2 Redemption. All you have to do is select these files, drag them into your directory. All right, continue. All right, so we have successfully installed Lenny Simple Trainer, and also we installed Script Hook. So now, since you want to start it with Script Hook, also, I do see this was updated. The controls are right here. So they do have a trainer now. They have no clip, okay? So for Script Hook, all you have to do is just click this, the Red Dead Redemption 2.exe. That will open up Red Dead 2 through this. But you have to make sure you open it up through this or you will not have script hook running in your game. So now uh, the game is opening up. So let's let the game open up and then I'll show you guys how to use the trainer and script hook. So once you open up Red Dead 2, just click, make sure you're on story. Never go online with mods or you'll get banned. Just click story. Also, sometimes the script hook may crash. If you do receive the crash, all you have to do is uh, restart your game and uh, try it again. And make sure when you do restart the game, you restart it through the script hook Red Dead 2.exe file. All right, so script hook is already up. You didn't need Simple Trainer because 
Scriptook already has a trainer now. To open it up, you just click F3. And they do have vehicles in here. Let's see if we can spawn. Oh, shoot. So you do have vehicles in here. You have boats. You can spawn a lot of stuff in here. So that's Scriptook. This is the trainer that's in Scriptook. You can change your model. Let's see. On oh, this one's it's not changing my model. Never mind about that. You can change the weather. So this is just a normal trainer, which is actually pretty cool because the script hook was just released yesterday and this came out like today. Alright, you can teleport to your waypoint. And soon this will be updated with more you know more features all right that's script hook but if you want to use a uh, lenny's trainer it is different so you can press f5 and use the arrow keys to change the weather i mean to change the time and weather so they they both work the same way but script hook trainer is actually pretty easier I'll, I'll leave the controls in the description and um well, that's how you install mods onto Red Dead 2 PC. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more mods and stay tuned for more videos. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and let's, let's get ready to see flying horses.